want him to be super protected like my baby, you know? <laughs> Marissa and her four-legged friend Jojo walk along Fountain Avenue in Brooklyn daily, dodging trash tossed in her neighborhood. She arms her service dog with booties. The, the um, garbage company pass by and clean all this almost all the time, you know, once or twice a month. And it's always every other week in the same thing. What are they dumping? They dump clothes, um, tires, furniture. The city of New York's Department of Sanitation is cracking down on illegal dumping with strict enforcement. Uh, we target illegal dumping, other quality of life violations. The department has been adding cameras in the five boroughs where the dumped debris keeps piling up. 250 are expected to be installed by summer. We see a variety of things, um, construction debris, household waste, yard waste. CBS2 spent the day with crews as they reviewed surveillance video. This was in the East Tremont section of the Bronx where furniture was left. Once he's done, he gets in the vehicle and drives off. And this was in Glendale, Queens, where cement was ditched on the side of the road. We then rode along with officers to several areas in Brooklyn and Queens, where despite these signs, bags of yard waste were taking up public space. Some of this material came from a vehicle that's on under investigation. As you can see, this is yard waste. To try to look for material with a name or an address. Officers track illegal dumpers using their license plates or information found in their trash and give them a $4,000 summons and impound their vehicle until the fine is paid. The sanitation department's definition of illegal dumping requires material to be discarded from a vehicle and be more than a cubic yard. That's three feet wide by three feet long by three feet deep. The city says calls of chronic dumping are rising, over 4,000 in 2022 and close to 1,000 already this year. It does affect minority and low-income communities more than it affects other communities. The hazard. It's toxic waste sometimes. But the commissioner tells CBS2 the cameras are working. So far this year, there have been 28 illegal dumping impounds compared to only five the same time last year. Illegal dumping is a big problem because it is an abuse of our communities and our streets. It's a theft of public space. New Yorkers say it's also an eyesore and done with no regard for the people who work and live nearby. It's very upsetting. Jennifer Bisram. CBS 2 News.